Hi guys, so for today's video is about how I draw face. By the way, I'm using Infinite Painter. In this artwork, I used canvas size perfect for IG, 2160. This are my references that I'm going to draw later. So first off, use tapered inker for the outline then start sketching. This is freehand sketching. I always start with the eyebrows or sometimes with the eyes. That's because, this part is easy for me lol. I don't know, but I always start in the right side area but we draw in where and how comfortable we are, right? So, if you tell how I draw the outline this is how I actually draw the outline when I'm practicing but usually I used grid method for the accuracy of the proportions. If you are a beginner, YouTube will teach you to trace lol, but hey, don't waste your skills doing that it's actually cheating yourself and hindering your ways to improve your skills with sketching. Sketch is the very first step in every drawing so this is actually important. You already have the skills to draw but difference is you are not drawing in an actual paper but you draw digitally and it is unexpectedly hard than you think. Some people will say that digital art is easy but yeah, it's easy after years of practice lol. It's not easy in the very first try. It's way too complicated. In my early days of learning digital art, I actually use only one layer because I have no idea what to do and what's the tool is about. It's so many tool to use, there's layering, clipping and funny, there's too much brush to choose from, and funny, there's blending tool that I don't have any idea that tool will make my life easy and fun. I used different applications available in Android and I actually used my phone and my fingertips to draw. And then years passed, someone asked me if I have YouTube channel. Because he wanna know how is my drawing process and then eventually, I created a channel then upload some drawing time lapses and he subscribe and then one follows and another and voila, you are watching my videos too. Lol, I really don't plan to make a channel but it changed my life actually. Now, I'm a full-time artist and also a graphic artist sometimes. I draw and design. I really don't have any idea that my life will change this way but it's actually so fulfilling for me because this is actually my dream. So, back to the drawing process, you don't need a perfect drawing but a good proportions and you must copy the reference like 80 to 90% because the result is dependent on your outline so take time with sketching. This is a drawing practice so I have prepared many reference like 5 reference to draw. I actually don't stick with only one reference because it will bored me. In this video, I'm going to show you how I draw the face, the eyes, lips and nose. From sketching to finishing the drawing.
Hi again guys, I finished the sketching, finally, so here, I'm going to show you how to color your sketch. Use brush maker brush, you can download this brush in the community, okay? What color to use? Hum. First off, select the midtone. But in here, I choose pink red color and apply to all. Pink red is actually my base for my drawing style but I will make sure to draw realistically as possible, even though I started the base for my art style colors ha ha ha. For beginners, you just select the midtone of your reference, to know this midtone as your base is a color means. They aren't too light or too dark, the color sits in the middle so for example in this lips whereas the color is mostly in pink, Try to figure out what color sits in the middle, because we can't color it right if we start with dark tones ha ha ha. So, here, we have pink. But as you can see, it doesn't have only one color, everything has a color value there's light and there's darker color but obviously, there's actually a midtone to this. Select the color from dark to light, then select the mid part, after that apply that color as your base. And that's it. After applying the base, we start to color or paint the rest. The brush to use is either brush maker or dry ink. For beginner, don't depend on copying the rest of the color to use by picking the color to the reference because you are cheating again to yourself lol but I can't force you to follow all my tips to draw or paint, just to do the right thing, okay? Play with colors, it will enhance your skills. That's it guys, then use the blending tool to blend the colors you apply. Thank you. 
Thank you.